afternoon, everyone. I'm so excited today to be here with Father Ralph Morgan and just let him uh, chat with you for a minute. Good afternoon. It is just a, a joy and a pleasure for Terry, my wife, and I to have accepted the call to come and be the next rector of Calvary Episcopal Church. I am fairly familiar with some of you and this area, and we are just overjoyed with the opportunities that y'all are offering to us to come share with y'all. Um, coming back down to, to Southeast Texas or wherever this really is, West Houston, um, from the East Texas area is going to be a, um, an opportunity that we've uh, just, we've psyched ourselves up for. We're very excited about it. We've loved being in East Texas. Neither one of us had ever spent much time other there, up there other than my wife having attended SFA. Um, but I went to school at Houston Baptist right down the street and have grown up in the Southwest Houston area and am very much looking forward to being here with you. Um, I will be sending you a letter in the next few days telling you a little bit more about us and asking you a couple of questions so that you can tell me a little bit more about you. And I look forward to seeing y'all in about a month and um, look forward to worshiping with you and, and sharing ministry together. Thank you for this call, for this opportunity, and um, many blessings to all of us. Thank you. Thank you. We're, we're all very excited. I have a couple of announcements. Uh, Tim Hillis has started a Bible study on Ephesians, which is a six-week program. I think week one was last week. It's Thursdays at 7. So if you're interested, let Tim know, and he'll make sure that you're included in the Zoom invitation. Betty Ann and Sheila Phillips have teamed up to do some programming for our kiddos. Uh, you will get a link to Sheila's story. I have to put my glasses on here. Uh, called Charlie Boy Looks for an Angel and then Betty Ann will be posting some questions all about angels so you can watch for that. This Sunday we're going to depart from uh, what we've been doing for worship with the Liturgy of the Word and Dan Bradley is going to be leading us in morning prayer this Sunday so I hope you will uh, join us and, and tune in for that. I know we all love Dan and uh, his, his ministry. And then finally, we are going to do the Blessing of the Pets. It's that time of the year, Sunday, October 4th at 4 o'clock. Uh, Reverend Nancy will be out here in the Circle Drive, and you can bring whatever critters you have. Uh, will Mason will be providing music. We'll have a little bit of a liturgy. Uh, you, I don't know if we can get your pets to socially distance. We will ask you to do that. But come out on Sunday, October 4th for the Blessing of the Pets. So... Uh, with that, I think we will ask Father Ralph to close us in prayer. Let us pray together. Gracious Father, we thank you for the love that you offer to us. We thank you for the opportunities that you are laying in front of us that we can come together and minister and reach out in this community to those who need to know Jesus Christ as their Savior. Father, thank you for this family, for this church family. And Father, I thank you for my family in Lufkin, that they will be as um, excited about the opportunities that you have for them. Father, be with this parish, the people of Calvary Episcopal Church, and honor the offerings that we give to you through our service, through our love, and our offerings. And we ask that you would bless us in Jesus' name. And may the blessing of God Almighty, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit be with you and remain with you always. Amen. Yeah.